Hearing you or someone you love has acute myeloid leukemia, AML, can be overwhelming. It's normal to feel this way, and you are likely to have many questions and concerns. What is AML? Why did I get it? How do you treat it? How will I get through this? Acute myeloid leukemia, or AML, is a rare form of cancer that typically affects people over the age of 65 and is slightly more common in males than females. AML is a type of blood cancer that starts in the bone marrow, the soft inner part of the bone where stem and blood cells are formed. Stem cells and three main types of blood cells are created in the bone marrow. White blood cells, red blood cells, and platelets. With AML, abnormal blood cells, called blasts, multiply quickly, upsetting the growth and normal function of healthy cells. There are eight main subtypes of AML, depending on which cell the leukemia came from. While all subtypes upset normal blood cell levels, different types of AML are associated with certain symptoms and behave differently after treatment. Signs and symptoms of AML can be similar to the flu or other less serious illnesses. These can include fever, shortness of breath, loss of appetite, dizziness and headaches, weight loss, bruising or bleeding easily, fatigue, and bleeding under the skin. Many signs and symptoms of AML occur when there are not enough normal blood cells. This happens when the leukemia cells crowd out the normal blood-making cells in the bone marrow. Because blood cells grow very quickly, it's possible to have no symptoms and normal blood work even a few weeks or months before a diagnosis of AML. We don't know what causes most cases of AML. There is no way to prevent it, and you can't catch AML from somebody else. While there are some risk factors for AML, such as older age, previous chemotherapy or radiation treatments, smoking, genetic abnormalities, or certain blood disorders, most people who develop AML have no identifiable risk factors. AML gets worse quickly and may lead to serious infections and organ failure if not treated. So it is important to start treatment as soon as possible after diagnosis. AML can be difficult to cure, but advances have been made and treatment options now include chemotherapy, radiation therapy, stem cell transplant, targeted therapy, immunotherapy, or a clinical trial. Chemotherapy is the main treatment for most types of AML. Chemotherapy is a drug treatment that uses powerful chemicals to kill the fast-growing cancer cells in your body. Your treatment depends on the subtype of AML, the genetic makeup of the leukemia, and your overall health and age. How well you do depends on your type of AML, the results of your lab tests, and many other factors. It is important to know that you will be able to better manage your AML and have a better quality of life by reaching out, communicating with your healthcare team, and surrounding yourself with a support network. You are not alone. The Leukemia and Lymphoma Society of Canada is here to help you understand AML and manage the road that lies ahead.